What's up, you guys? I'm here at YCS New Jersey with my boys, Joe Grizz, Asian Persuasion, you already know. Already we are here with <laughs> the one and only, the Pendulum God. <laughs> shout out to Sam. He introduced this guy to us, too. Would you like to introduce yourself, sir? And right. Shout out your YouTube channel. For those of you who don't know me, uh, uh, I am Steven Trifonoski from Triff Gaming, a.k.a. the Pendulum God. The Pendulum Master, the one and only, I am legend, shout out Will Smith, I am the greatest. For those of you who, who never seen my profile, I played 60 card pendulums today. What did I do? I talked. Top 60 card two, pendulums! Baby. Who said pens are dead? I who said it. pens are dead? I did. At me. Because you don't know anything about Yu-Gi-Oh! Okay? 60 card pendulums, 4 negates, 5 negates, 6 negates, 7 negates, every turn. Easy. Hand trap me? No problem. No problem. <laughs> Three negates, no problem. <laughs> they can't do anything. Guys, if you think pendulums are dead, watch this video, it'll change your life. It's <laughs> gonna change your God's plan. So, first of all, <laughs> the greatest pendulum in history. Wisdom Eye, magician. Ah. It's all the magicians here. We play three of these, we play two of these, and one of these. You don't need that big of a magician core, you only need enough that do, do all the job. Yeah. Three Wisdom Eyes. Harmonize is needed for a combo. I'll show you guys in the very end of the video the combo where you have like an easy four negates through like the shittiest of hands. Yeah. But Harmonize is neat. Like these are amazing. And then two of each of these, nothing's more needed. Poison's actually a Garnet going first. And one of each of these, Black Fang's garbage. But you need a uh, scale eight to add with pen call. And you play six pen calls. So you need all this. the perfect engine. That's Magicians. And then for the Turbo cards, we got three Chronograph, three Cerberus. Three curtain razor, and we got uh, four, one foolish, and three shrine. Some people play one foolish, one shrine, but come at me, play sixty cards, you can play come three. At me, bro. Come at me, bro. <laughs> All these is thirteen, and I side some more going first, but I'll get to that later. And then, uh, so that's it for the turbo cards and the plus cards. So the way you should play the deck now is the minimal amount of magicians because they're actually garnets. You just want them in the scale. You want them in the scale. And that's it. You want them in the scale and you want to pen harmonize it. You don't want to draw too much of it. You want to see one or two or a pen call. No more. Anything else is just a brick. It's like drawing a key turtle. Yeah. But they're level four, so whatever. So that's the most you should play. Next, the plus cards. These are very important. Three Bambuku mm. and Nekomano. One plus. card Totem Burn. One, one card plus, plus, plus. Everything pluses. Yeah. It's not a normal summon. It's not normal or special. So you loop Chrono, the whole point of the deck. Draw one of the 13 I just showed you, or one of the 16 going first, because I have three showing, uh, uh, three in the side deck that I'll show later. But you draw one of those 16 or 13, and you win the duel. Yeah. Because you send a Chrono to extra, special the Chrono, special one of the 1,000 plus cards I'm going to show you guys, and you get infinite pluses. Yeah. You get infinite Electrums, and infinite fodder for the Electrums, and then you just destroy their life. Yeah. So <laughs> these are the Magic Spectres, more pluses, then we got three Dark Worm 2-0, Drawing Dark Worm is not the worst because you can just normal summon and get the plus. It's a plus one. Like, it's uh, so this part of it. So, drawing these are not Garnets. Even drawing this is not a Garnet. There's no such thing as a Garnet in a Pendulum deck. There's only such thing as Garnets and Trick Stars because the whole deck is Garnets. So, they can't do anything. So, you draw this, pop it with Electro. Lit. Like, you can have the greatest card in your deck. You draw the greatest card in your deck, pop it with Electro, and do the same thing as this. Yeah. You just want anything to pop and then you keep going. And then this, 3DD Kepler and a Thomas. Oh. Why? Because Kepler add contract. Mm. Contract add Thomas. Mm. Thomas add Kepler. That's Plus combo. three for free. Didn't Would you ever know. need any of these cards? No. But you <laughs> special electro. <laughs> pop pop a card. So it's one of the three. Special chrono. Special the, the Kepler. And now you got the fodder for free. You got the fodder for free. Remember when Astrograph Astrograph was a plus three because Astrograph you would loop it three times in one turn if you followed my four negate build yeah. or if you were an idiot and played like uh, Starving Venom FTK then don't watch this video go away I don't like you but this you, Astrograph was never banned like this because you get the plus three off of Kepler yeah. if you don't hard draw the Kepler you send it with Electrum and if you hard draw a Chrono or a Kepler you get a plus three so yeah. Astrograph actually never left the deck which is why I destroyed everyone today nice and then three abductor because you play 18 spells plus three chronograph which leaves a scale is 21 plus three curtain razor leaves a scale 24. you play 24 spells in the deck 
three Kepler searches a spell, 27 spells. So you play 27 spells, of every time I drew a Duck Guard, I resolved this effect, and it's unbelievably broken, especially for Brandish, which is literally the entire meta, because you put it in your scale, I got even lead one game, I got even lead, I got sphere moded, and then I got even lead. I got sphere moded, and then I got even lead. I had 20 people watching the game. I left an abductor. I left an abductor. The guy did it, he's an idiot. He didn't pop my abductor even though he could have. He wanted, he was very greedy. He wanted to get some more pluses with engage and stuff. Yeah. So I love my abductor. Because I'm a god, I drew Duelist Alliance. <laughs> Duelist Alliance, get Pendulum Call. Abductor, get Dark Worm. Pen Call, oh, Dark bro. Worm. And you already know the rest, I OTK'd him. You killed him that turn, bro. Then, re one Rescue Hamster. I go to Rescue Hamster every duel. Every duel. You don't need three, because you only want to use his Banish effect. The normal effect is like a bonus. Banish, of, bro, Wisdom Eye, put two Wisdom, uh, just get two in there. Hamster get scales for free. Yeah, Hamster's key. key. One or three, no matter what. One Luster, only because you play Triple Duelist Alliance, so you need any monster in the deck that says Pendulum. And also because he's an OG. He's an OG. I was about to play Pendulum before I'm about Sorcerer with no other Pendulum as targets. Just because I love him. I decided last second Luster will help out. He, he's a, he was a good addition. And two Jackal for Cerberus. And when you get trolled, people say, what do you do in your troll, bro? I say, bro, learn how to play Yu-Gi-Oh! Because you just said Jackals, <laughs> said Jackals with Electrum, and you get free Monster Negates. Yeah. Sure, I, I like two free Macabas on board for nothing, like, yeah, no problem. Free. You, you do that with your, you play Ma uh, Magic Specters, remember? Because you're you're the GOAT, yeah, and you play Magic Specters. So you get a free Totem Bird. So you got Totem Bird and Jackals through a troll, no negate, problem. Like, yeah. what are you going to do to two Monster Negates and, a, and a negate it evenly? You can't yeah. do nothing. So the spells, we have the two, that's all the monsters, the two contracts I talked about earlier, the foolish and three shrines I talked about earlier, and then every draw card known in Yu-Gi-Oh! existence, that's good. <laughs> three desires, three allures, and then three pen call and three duelist alliance. So you have six pen calls, and if you happen to draw too many spells, and you want more monsters in your hand, duelist alliance get luster pendulum, and then, so it's, it's lit. And then yeah. pen call, always do your best to have a harmonizing in hand. I'll explain a combo later where uh, any two sevens and any two fours equals four negates and three two three cards in hand plus full scales and a set desires yeah. or like any spell card you have set desires set pen call because uh, of Griffin and it's like too good like I, I got evenly five times this whole tournament five times five. not once not two times not three times not four five want well, to know what happened all those five times you won I won all five you won all I five. won all five <laughs> tell me a pendulum deck that, that could win five times getting sphere moded. Yeah. And it, four of those five, I swear on my life, I swear on the Almighty God Kirin that <laughs> rest in peace, sweet rest friends. in peace. I swear that four of those five, after the sphere moon, I got evenly. I still won. Still won, baby. <laughs> I still uh, yeah. won. I'm undefeated, never lost. <laughs> Shout out to Lord Paul. That's a sixty card brick. Sixty card. Sixty card perfection. Perfection. Now side deck. Three speedroid passing glider. <laughs> Want to know the only thing I sided the whole tournament? That card. This. <laughs> these nine cards I didn't even side once. We got red reboot. So don't even worry about these ones. Don't even. <laughs> you don't even need these. Just these. Just Point side first, the It's a free photon thrasher. You play sixteen instead of thirteen. Will you now have sixteen win conditions? Sure. Sixteen exodias like. It's Next, GG. I don't really don't need more main decks because it's perfect. So I have three extra deck cards: Tornado and Omega. I was a monkey and I didn't main deck Tornado Dragon, so I left it in the side deck for <laughs> anti spell. And then just the, this for cherries, this for anti spell. Going second, you play this. Going first, you play this. Yeah. And there's always in the extra deck one or two cards that are only good going first or going second. So you just switch them out. And yeah. then the literally the MVP of the whole extra deck after Electrum, Cowboy. Uh, Cowboy. Who knows game. how many games I won with Cowboy? Did you go so that is the side. Next, the extra. Enough said. <laughs> Enough said. Stick Electra to the game plan. Stick good. to the game plan. Game plan Three right Electrums, there. Firewall in the middle, Exodia. <laughs> Nightmare Goblin, Underclock Taker. Goblin is probably the next card I'm taking out, but it's still good because it's a free card and it's uh, having the arrows helps out a lot. Metaltron, because when you brick or when they open Infinity Hand Traps, you go Metaltron and then Pen 3, Harmonize, you still get five monsters. Firewall, because, again, Fire. enough said. Griffin, <laughs> enough said. Gr every single turn is Griffin, Firewall, Jackal, Vortex. That's so those are it's the four cards I do that I think is an auto win. It, it's absolutely unstoppable for any deck to break. They're playing Draco, and if they're playing they Draco, Draco, I just go a Dweller instead. So that's auto win itself. Yeah. I don't, it, Dweller passes auto win itself. Yeah, so that's all. That's the end board. 
uh, with the, the jackal and the things, the totem bird, because you, you, you play Bambuku and Cat. Uh, at the end of the day, totem bird and two jackals is game as well. Yeah. Why overthink things? If I see that, I just like, bro, I'm not going to stop wasting time. He's going to summon two jackal and totem bird and you still win. Time start because needy for the combo, I'll explain later. Dweller because Dweller. I would rather Tornado though. Uh, Naruto, uh, these, and then Ignister. I only play Ignister in case uh, I face a bunch of dudes playing Kuki that don't know how to extra link. So I would yeah. just take care of the nightmares and then I uh, win. But I'm taking this over Borla. Borla. Nice. So that's the extra. See and ya. now I'm going to show you guys just the one basic combo uh, with one curtain razor and any four random cards we draw. Alright, let's see it, baby. Alright, you'll cut that. I gotta like fix it there. So that was a profile, now we're gonna do a sick combo tutorial. Let's My boy it, John over here. Hey, Looking on YouTube. Let's go, baby. <laughs> it's your boy. It's your boy. He's gonna shuffle. The pendulum and, god. Thank you, thank you. He's gonna shuffle and cut my deck. I made this video on Savage Channel earlier where I made a combo tutorial. People were hating because uh, the video was cut. Cut. I swore, man. What do you want me to do? Put some swear swearing on a 140,000 subscriber channel? I'm not yeah. doing that. So we have to cut it. Then haters talk crap. But I was like, bro, you know what? Allow them. I don't yeah, even care. Because whatever. So cut the deck, bro. Shuffle it up, baby. Do Shuffle, what you cut, do. power, whatever you want, bro. Because I'm putting up four negates easy. <laughs> <laughs> The pendulum god is ready, bro. Wait till he draws his five. He's gonna play. Bro, to make it fair, I should I play with the first three cards? Oh my god. <laughs> oh, okay. Let's okay. see. Then we'll do five, but he I can probably do it the first over here doing crazy shuffles. Let's go, baby. Proper, when proper. you get bored one day and learn how to be a blackjack dealer. <laughs> when you get bored one day, there you go. You got another part time job on the side right there, right? You guys all seen so. it. Shuffle to the max. That was basically a power shuffle times 10. Times ready? 10. Let's go, baby. First card. We lit. We lit. That's game. Oh my god. We lit. I don't. We not lit. <laughs> All right. Five cards. Here's the beauty of it. Do you know what Lord of Darkness does? He draws it cards. says draw two cards. <laughs> well, guess what? We play 13 turbo cards. So two out of 13, we're drawing one. We're drawing one. Allure. That's. Oh, we play Magical terrible. Abductor. What's Magical Abductor do? It's a pseudo turbo card. Pseudo turbo. So, now we banish a card. We banish the the gate zero. No, we'll banish the purple poison. So next, this is our hand now. We use the lore, banish the purple poison. Now you gotta be crafty. You have to stick with the game plan. <laughs> You're gonna make three electrums. Before your pendulum. Before your pendulum summon. Is that the, game the three electrums. That's the game plan. Sorry, I'm behind. So we have no turbo cards, but we have a magical abductor. For anyone who doesn't know what abductor does, it says activate it and Exodia, you win the duel. So we start with Dark Contract. We're gonna add Kepler. Now, drawing Kepler is thousand times more broken than drawing Contract. Because Kepler, you get a plus three. Contract's only a plus two. Yeah. But the plus three with Kepler, you get multiple monsters. This you only get a monster and a spell. But it's free spells, so it doesn't really matter. So one, next we're gonna normal summon Kepler. So now, Abductor has one. And with Kepler, we're going to add another contract. Because Kepler can only add a contract or send something, but that's yeah, irrelevant. It's we a add contract. Three, so all three cards, and any continuous spell oh. is a pseudo pendulum because Electrum is going to pop it. Electrum. So it's all good. So one spell for Abductor. Next, make that two spells for Abductor. Uh huh. Next. Jackal. We're gonna send Jackal. The whole combo involves harmonizing. So we're gonna add harmonizing and a block fang. And then block both. fang is gonna be the scale we're gonna use at the very end. And harmonizing is gonna be the monster you pendulum summon eventually to get up a bunch of negates on board. Searching for a one of in a sissy card deck is a lot of work. <laughs> <laughs> He's not wrong. Well you guys just see it. Three spells. I mean, you play 28 options to 28 spells. If you can't go into two spells and yeah, activate any scale, like, what are you doing? You know, so that's three spells. We're gonna activate Abductor's Effect. To add Astrograph's twin brother, Chronograph. Chrono, baby. <laughs> My boy. We got Chronograph. Activate our free turbo card we just got. Bring out Time Gazer. Also, a mission to search an assistant card deck. Electro. Activate Electrum's effect. So now, you gotta be crafty. 
<laughs> with Electrum's effect, you always want to send chronograph, but you already have a chronograph. You always want a harmonizing hand. You already have a harmonizing hand. Oh, so, so now you gotta be crafty. How can I get some pluses? You got some pluses off Kepler already. So now, Mabuku and Dark Worm. You haven't resolved any of their effects. So you're gonna slowly buy and hamster. So you're slowly by slowly gonna send dark worms, hamsters, mabukus, and any level four magician because it'll just help for the end combo. So we're gonna do we're gonna send a dark worm. At the moment it's irrelevant, but eventually we're gonna we're gonna need it. Next, we're going to uh, these spells. We're gonna pop with a second and third electro. You do not need to pop them now. Pop them only at the very end at because you want to get the free a draw one off Electrum ASAP. So we're gonna put we're under pen calls, so we can't pop magicians. So we're gonna activate uh, Gate Zero. So we're gonna pop Gate Zero. We're gonna add the Chrono Chronograph, mm -hmm. and then we're gonna special the Chronograph. We're gonna special the Harmonizer. And no worries, we're gonna search. The, we're gonna add the Harmonizing back to our hands. But you know what? No, no, no. To be safe, we're gonna special the Black Pen. It's not that big of a deal. We can special the Harmonizing, but. We're probably gonna draw eight scale because we we the pen gods. We the pen gods. So next we go into a le oh we well, sorry we draw after that. So now would you like to cut good sir? Yeah. Draw a random card. Because we don't stack out here. Electrum's draw. We play sixty pendulums. You we play pendulum. four cards we don't want to draw. We just don't want to draw a foolish burial or a three shrines. Anything else and we win. We are we win. We definitely win. Abductors at two counts. Don't forget that the opening hand was so suboptimal, we're still opening ending up on four interruptions, four negates. Yeah. Electrum. At this point, you gotta think. You don't have it. You're not gonna have a uh, eight scale. So you want to pen the harmonizing. So you want to slowly but surely find a way to have an eight scale plus a level four magician in here. So what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna summon. We are going to send. We're gonna send a purple poison. No, actually no. We're sending. We're setting a chronograph. So our third election is going to be a rescue hamster, and our scales are going to be two chronograph with a free chronograph in hand. Oh, yeah. So we're going to do that now. Electrum, if I pop the contract, add one of the chronographs. Mm -hmm. Special chrono, special luster. Oh baby. Electrum number three. Electrum. Stick to the game plan. <laughs> Stick to the game plan. <laughs> Next, brother. we send rescue hamster. We just sent two chronos. So we're going to add those chrono backs, chronos back for free. Electrum, pop the other contract, three pluses, let's go. Hamster, hamster, scale, banish. Add two chronographs. Next. Oh, baby, that's a combo. So we got scale three, a bunch of scale eights. We're now gonna go with the firewall. We're gonna now activate the chronograph. We're now going to pendulum summon. You want a pendulum summon? One level four, magician, and one level seven, and a harmonizing from hand. It's very easy to send with electrums to make sure this happens. I've been doing this to people all day. <laughs> and we pendulum the harmonizing. Don't pendulum summon anything from here because harmonizing is special another level seven. You could, if you have another level seven in your extra, special summon it, and then this harmonizing from hand could just be any magician. Yeah. But Adding uh, harmonizing is very easy, so you don't even need to worry about the other seven. So we're gonna special Janky Magician. Janky. Janky is janky, but like he's jank, but level seven, uh, he's level seven. <laughs> so we're gonna make with what we got, and it's important that he's dark as well for other uh, situations. But we're gonna go into Time Star Magician, and absolute. Next, we're gonna activate Time Star's effect. Detach. Add Jackal. This is about to be wild. Next, we're going to link a two, a one, and a one into Griffin, triggering all effects. All effects. Vortex, Jackal, Griffin. Discard, set your follow up, and draw one. Oh, baby. This board, I did on everybody. And there was not one turn where I was uninterrupted and I did not do this. We could have done even more, but we had a chronograph. 
You get a special time gazer out and put, have Firewall have an extra link. Another arrow beside it. But this is just a basic combo and I don't wanna I don't wanna complicate things because this can this be done easily. All the time. This is an auto win. Why extend? Why extend? They're not winning unless they have a sphere mode. They are not. It's impossible. Name me anything that's relevant that could break this. Cookie? Good luck, have fun. Because all I need is one jackal, let alone all four of these. Trick stars, I could normal I could special summon chronograph and have none of these. And I'll still win the duel. <laughs> Brandish, you need one vortex and one jackal, you win the duel. Yeah. Pendulums, maybe they'll break this board. But that's the only thing. Yeah. That's about it. So that's a combo that's tutorial. A combo, that's it. Guys. That's it for the video. My Shout YouTube outs. is Shout Trip outs, Gaming. Truth Trip Gaming. Trip T R I F Gaming. Link will be in the description below. Nice. All I do is put up sick pendulum combos. Sick. That's all I do. I sit in my lab downstairs in my house, <laughs> play some dueling book, wreck everybody I, I face, <laughs> undefeated, and just put sick combos up. So follow me. Shout out to all you guys and uh, peace. Hey, take it easy, bro. Congrats.